Hi my YouTube friends, Pinguina here with another video. Um, as you can see, I am in my car once again, but it's during the day, not at night. Um, I did want to let you guys know that I'll be driving into Vegas today to pick up the equipment for that one role that I told you guys that I took on. Um, so I did tell you guys I did sign a contract with a known company here internationally. And so I'm going to be working collections for them. And I got my glasses, my beautiful outfit of the day. They didn't want us to wear jeans. I don't understand why because, you know, we're going to just go, I'm just going to go pick up the equipment and then bring it back home, set it up in my office. And then I'll bring you bits and pieces of that. But so that's basically what I'm going to be doing today. And I'll show you like real quick my view. It's kind of weird. There's my view. Those are my other cars. Ta-da. Yes, Toyota. We love Toyota. And I am in a Toyota. Ta-da. Right here. All right, oh, I gotta get gas, oh no, so I better hurry up. Okay, so see how it looks beautiful? Oh uh, yeah, and by the way, it is um, Eclipse Monday. But you guys won't be able to see this video until I post it and that's gonna be probably Wednesday. And then there's a school bus there. That's a church over there, it's a Catholic church. And more beautiness over there. Look at that, the beautiful clouds. But okay, so I just kind of wanted you guys to see that, and then there's my music there. Um, it is Christian music that I listen to, so, and we'll look, open it wider, but it's Spotify, and that's my playlist, and I've named it uh, Music for My Soul. I'll show you guys really quick, if you guys even care. Boop, boop, right here. It's the good morning. I have other playlists. But this is the one I usually listen to. And there's a few in Spanish, and then the rest is all in English. And then I'll show you, like, my favorite favorite is this one, Believer. I recommend it if you guys want to listen to it. I mean, that's the name of the, the author. The author. <laughs> that's the name of the uh, singer. Okay. Ta-da. All right, friends. So... I gotta go get gas first, and I can't be holding, of course, my phone while I drive. And so then I'm gonna let you guys go temporarily, and then I'll pick up one once I'm in the road, okay? But there I am, driving. See you guys in a little bit. Hey friends, okay. So I just got some gas, and now I'm headed to Vegas trip right here takes about an hour and I kind of I guess it well I tried cleaning my windshield but you know whatever but yeah so a reminder again this is the um, Eclipse Monday but um, I'm not gonna be able to hold my phone here for a minute because I'm gonna be doing some driving but I mean again I do have lane assistance cruise control that's all set up but once in a while, I have to tug on the wheel. And of course, you want to keep safe. So don't try this at home at all whatsoever. There you guys can see my beautiful face. One more time. All right. And then, so I'll bring you uh, later. Because it, again, the drive is an hour or so. All right, friends, check this out. I'm almost there. Kind of wanted to show you guys my view.
Okay, I wanted to show you guys that. That's, that's somebody's house right there. And they have like their own little windmill. <laughs> Isn't that cool? So I'm heading towards the um, Grand Canyon now. Um, I'm on a small street, so I can only go like 25 miles per hour. But look at that beautiful Red Rock Mountain already. And then I'll show you a little bit more just as, as soon as I get a little bit ahead. Because I'm coming up to a stop and I gotta pay attention to traffic. All right, be back. All right, so now I'm on the like Red Rock Highway. And if you see, I don't know if you guys can see closer in, but that right there is the gypsum. Like factory or something like that. Basically what they do is they make drywall right there. Pretty slow if you see the speed limit it says 50 miles per hour 
but I love it so I prefer taking this back road this back end I don't care if I have to go 50 miles an hour the thing is it's quieter for me um, there's less cars even though you see cars there's believe me there's a lot less cars that if, if I was to jump on the 15 north and then you know then take Summerlin Parkway that's if you guys are familiar with the area if not then don't worry about it or Google it Google's your friend but anywho so all of this here I and then nature I just love nature it's beautiful right why not it's God's creation who doesn't like God's creation it's beautiful look at that scenery you're not gonna get that money shot anywhere else just unless you're actually here or through my videos so there you go you're welcome <laughs> all right I'm just messing with you guys so um, the next shots gonna be where you guys will see more of the um, buildings and I'll show you a little bit of the casino if I can show you the casino because I'm not gonna be like raising my my camera or whatnot but I'll be back all right, friends, so here um, is basically entering Summerlin, exiting Red Rock. And then, of course, I have to like slow down because I have to go 35 here for a minute. And then that's everybody that's jumping in. As long as I stay in my lane, I'm good. Hopefully, though, you see people that don't care. And then, uh, nice Mercedes jump, jumped in front of me. And so I did want to show you real quick that that's basically the end of the route, scenic route. And here, look at that, the sky looks beautiful. I just, I just see it in the camera. Alright, and then there's a lot of um, houses and then the, just the Red Rock Casino is going to be if you guys pay attention, it's going to be on the right side. Not yet, though. But there you go. And then, of course, I'm going to show you guys. Um, I, I'm i pretty sure I won't be able to record in the building. Um, security reasons and whatnot. So, the next shot would probably be when I'm back home. And then, of course, I'm um, setting up everything for you guys. That way you guys can see how I set up my remote. My remote job. Okay, so there is Red Rock Casino. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it. It's on the right side. I'm sure you guys are amazed by the sky. Look at how beautiful that looks. But anyways, it's towards there. That behind those palm trees is the Red Rock Casino. But I'll be showing you guys if I can. If not, then if you Google it, you'll see how beautiful it looks. It's just called Red Rock Casino. All right, so stay tuned. Okay, there it is. Red Rock Casino. better on Google, okay? Google it. <laughs> Alright. I wanted to show you if I could, so there you go. Alright, so I wanted to show you guys real quick. This is the building that I came to pick up that equipment. Yada, 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 yada. Oh, it is going to be a long video. I see that. It's almost 11 minutes. But I'm not going to show you the name of the company or anything like that. And there I am chilling because I got here 20 minutes early so uh, so I'm picking up this equipment I'm sure it's like computer monitors the actual computer um, I'm not sure how many monitors hopefully they give me at least two minimum um, because you multitask and you do a lot of stuff emails just a lot so I'm hoping for two um, I'm honestly not sure how long I'm gonna do this um, maybe six months to a year um, hoping to get rid of my bills and get rid of like my cars and everything because again like I've told you guys before I do plan on moving to Central America um, six months to a year at least I'm not selling my house but I do want to sell like my vehicles and then like everything else that I have that's just mm, I don't need it 
right? Kind of become minimalist because I don't plan on buying a lot over there, but I also have a property and it is a small, it needs to get remodeled basically. I don't want to actually build like another house or anything like that. I just want to use what's there that my mom had made and then just remodel it. So by remodel, what it means for them there is just they need a bathroom, kitchen, because it's just like two rooms. It needs a new roof and all that stuff. So all that costs money. So that's why I'm taking this contract. And I don't want my husband to just use any of his money or whatever. So it's my property anyway. So not his. Technically, because my mother gave it to me. So, but of course he is going to come with me. So he says, right? <laughs> He's been there. I've taken him down twice. We've been twice to El Salvador, Central America. So he's seen it. But okay, I'm not going to go into that story. That's going to be like another video. See what I'm telling you guys? Every time I try to, I, like, I start with one topic and then I end up with another topic, so on and so forth. Okay, so it's 742 and then I see somebody walking up to the door and it's locked. So, okay, I'll just stay here and continue recording. So you guys can see my beautiful face still. <laughs> and um, so if you see back there, you can't barely see. You see the cross back there and the windshield in the back of my car? That's actually um, a dedication for my brother that passed away. Um, so if you guys have been following any of my videos um, from video number one, I kind of tell you guys why I started, you know, creating content or just sharing my story basically I don't even know if you want to call it creating content but um, and then I go on to other videos talking about other topics about my son um, some of them I do what basically me cooking and it's just a whole lot of everything right so that's pretty cool but anyways, so I got about 15 minutes, but I don't want to drag this on because I, I do want to show you guys my setup. I'm not going to show you the drive back because that's going to be boring. So the next time you guys see me, it's going to be in my office and I'll be setting up the equipment. And nosy um, Lucas is going to be there. He's always in, in the way. And then I'll show you guys that. But then officially after that, I like literally have to like start working them so yeah all right friends so i'm gonna let you guys go here we'll see you when i'm setting up um basically all my stuff for the collections all right friends bye hey friends okay i'm back <clears throat> so i'm in my office i'm not gonna show you like all of it because it's a hot mess but this is basically a little corner where i'll be working and I already picked up my equipment. I want to show you. And I do have trash right there. So that's why there's a bag here. But they gave me two monitors. So that's pretty awesome. And that's the computer Dell. And that's another one right there. And then they also gave me a webcam. Because I have to be on. Cable for the internet. That's my internet modem right there. Headset for when I make the calls, and then a surge protector. And that's my view out here. If you guys care to see that, and that sign just says no trespassing. That's it. All right, so I'm gonna pick up the trash there. Of course, I'm not gonna show you my trash, but and then I'll start assembling the monitors. And yes, I'm doing this by myself. And yes, I have done it before. All right, so stay tuned. Okay, so I was able to put it on this angle right here. And I'll go ahead and start pulling up. So the first thing I'm gonna set up is the search protector. This is just basically if it rains or any of that stuff happens, then the computer is protected. And the equipment basically is protected. And so don't mind me. I'm just going to be putting stuff up.
Okay. And so let me make sure I'm still recording here because I know my phone's a little messed up. There we go. Okay. So this is the first one. It's just paperwork. Put it to the side. And then so this is the computer monitor stand. Cables. This is going to go in the back of the monitor. Okay. And so here's the first monitor. Ta da! So that just sits right on top of this. Base. And now all I have to do is move this ginormous box because I know we want the monitors to be protected. So that's why they use such a heavy box. Okay. So then my first monitor will kind of go like this. Well, I did lose the base. Not supposed to be moving them around after you set them up anyway, so. And then from here, this is the one cable that's gonna go to the actual computer. And then this one's gonna go to the actual powering of the monitor. To the power search, basically. Okay. It's as easy as that. See? Of course, you're not going to see anything else because there's no computer. So it's just going to be like searching, searching, searching. Because I haven't unpacked the computer. I'm just unpacking the monitors first. Um, okay. Here's the second one. Cables, 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 and the stand. That's just wa warranty paperwork. Okay, so then this a little further back and then I'm going to put the computer right here because the computer is literally like that yay big here's the other stand so it's not really complicated um and if you like need assistance or whatever and in the box, basically, there is a paper. So I've done this before for when I was a banker. Again, that job was like super duper stressful with interest rates, you know, on the rise. And they wanted me to work 55, 50 to 55, sometimes 60 hours a week. I'm sorry, I don't know about <laughs> the rest of the world, but. No, thank you. I was done. Okay, so remember, this is a remote job, so this is my home. And this is where I'm setting it up. At home. Okay. And then there's monitor number two. And then, of course, you know, as I'm sitting, like, actual the computer, after I have all that stuff up, there's an ethernet cable for the internet, um, camera, and 
So this this is all brand new according to them. Looks pretty brand new. Okay. There's a Logitech little cam camera. Mm -hmm. I can pull it out. It's like stuck in there. I'm pulling the little tab and look, there came the little tab. It like literally has a little tab so you can pull it out. Like the little tab ripped off. There we go. So then here's the camera and then I just have to figure out a way to connect it to the monitor. Which I'll do and I won't go into too much detail. So I'll just show you guys the setup of the monitors because I know my video is going to be pretty long already. Okay, again, this is the power cable. And I'm hoping that it's going to actually fit. And then this goes right underneath. And then that just goes down there. And I don't want to have cables everywhere. So there's computer, I mean monitor number two. So I'll just kind of have it right there like that. Then I'll figure out a camera because I don't think they gave us a camera stand. This is just paperwork for the camera. And eventually I'll throw everything away. And then these, this is basically going to connect to the actual like computer headset. So the headset looks like this for whoever is not familiar with customer service. Now, of course, the company that I'm going to work for, just so you know, um, for people who do work remote and everything like that, we do have to pass a background check, an extreme background check because we are going to be handling specific information so again i'm not going to go into all the details for the particular company but this is a standard headset that they give you jabra okay and then the bag dust collector bag camera and then in this box um, how I can show it to you guys. So the keyboard is in here. And I'll show you guys what the actual computer looks like. This is the actual computer right there. This little thing. That's it. And then the mouse. And everything is wired, um, I guess they don't really want us to have wireless for whatever reason. I never technically like to invest my own personal money. Maybe I should because then it would make my job easier, right? But at the same time, I'm okay with not being as easy. So then I showed you guys pretty much everything there. Of course, you can't really see the rest of everything. And that took all 11 minutes. Um, of course, I have to connect other cables and whatnot. But once the setup is complete, then I'll show you guys how it actually looks like without providing you any other information so I won't get in trouble. All right, so stay tuned. All right, friends, there we go. Everything's being set up. That's just company information. I don't want to show you guys. But there's the date. It is the 8th. There's monitor 1. Monitor 2. Yeah, you see my junk over there in the closet. Keyboard. Camera. I haven't connected the camera. It shouldn't be hard. There the computer's working and everything. Ethernet. So, alright. So, there we go, my friends. Um, please don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the video. And... Um, let me turn my camera around real quick so you can see my 
messy hair. Oop, there I am. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's a hot mess. Okay, driving into Vegas for an hour. It feels like it, my hair even got greasy and just like the time. And my lipstick's gone because I, I had lunch. Um, I don't wear a lot of makeup. That's going to be like a whole other video on why. Oh, yeah. And I wanted to tell you guys something really funny. Okay. So when I was picking up the equipment, there's a, they were all female. There was just one male. He literally looked like he was like 26, 27 years old. Um, as I was sitting in my car, he knocks on the window, ready to take off. Okay, mind you, I already had all my equipment and everything. And he comes up to me and he's like, um, hey, I uh, just wanted to tell you that you look beautiful. And are you married? And then I was like, sir, wedding ring? Did you not see my wedding ring? <laughs> and I show it to him. And and um, I don't know. He's like a young kid. He's literally my, my children's age. So I'm going to go ahead and look at all my grays. My white hairs, gray hairs, whatever color you want to call them. I'm going to go comb my hair, brush my teeth because I'm done with lunch. And so you get to see the hot mess version of myself today. Yay. <laughs> all right. So don't forget, I love you guys so much. Uh, please stay tuned for the next videos. This one's going to go up on, I'll try to post it tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, yeah, Tuesday. So you're not that far behind. I usually just recently started posting Wednesdays and Saturdays. But I'll try to do And this one's going to be pretty long because this is 14 minutes. The first part was like um, 11 minutes. So it's going to be like 30 minute video. And I got to like combine them. And my commentary boxes because you know I don't edit. So all my hot mess, everything that you guys see, you guys get. I'm not going to like stop it here, go get makeup and... I don't have time for none of that. This is the real me. This is what you get. Okay. If you like my content, then you stay subscribed. And if you don't, see ya. Find somebody else because there's plenty out there. Promise. There is. And I won't get hurt. Trust me. There'll be others. All right. <laughs> but for the ones that are sticking around, for the ones that want to know what I'm going to be doing, I love you guys so much. Thank you for all your support. I have like 31 subscribers. I'm excited. I don't care. I mean, 31 is 31, but still. Love it. So slowly growing. I'm patient. Don't you worry. I got six months to a year is when I plan to move to El Salvador. And again, that's going to be temporary. I just want to do it. Just because I want to be closer to my mom's um, land. Uh, that's where she was born. My mother's from uh, El Salvador. And I've been there twice, but it's only like um, about 17 to 18 days each time that I have gone, which I feel is not enough. I think you should like live in the culture. You should see everything. Of course, enjoy the food that I do already. I know how to make it. Um, if you look in my previous videos, you'll actually see some Salvadoran food in there, Mexican food. I really haven't. And I cook a lot of Mexican. I actually had, I actually made pozole last night, um, the green kind. And see, look at that. I'm already at 16 minutes. My bad. Okay, because I start chit-chatting and I have to log back in here and, and a few. I got like 30 more minutes left before I have to like actually be in. on. But then I still have other equipment to look to put together. But, um, you know, I'll, I'll let you guys go right here. And of course, I'll bring you guys more videos. Again, oh my gosh, look at how messy I look. But I promise you, I shall word and all. It's just, it just happens because, you know, it was windy, you roll the windows down in your car and you enjoy the breeze and then this happens. And then I started putting my equipment together, had lunch real quick, and then Lucas is all, all over my office door trying to come in, but not yet. I'll let him in eventually because I got to clean up. I have to ask to see if I can just throw these boxes away because I don't want to keep them, but see what they tell me in my Zoom meeting today. But all right, friends. There we go. All right. Don't forget, just like I always tell you in my other videos, you you do you. I'll do me. And then we'll see you in the next video. I have to give you that health update too, right? All right. May God bless you all. Bye.